Lee, you said to me on Saturday you wanted a reaction and jolly ho, you got one tonight, didn't you? Absolutely fantastic performance. Uh, everything that you said uh, on Saturday rang home and put in a tremendous performance against the league leaders, let's say, you know, what a great game. Well, we, uh, yeah, so we spoke about before the game that we needed to start, start properly. We needed to get on the front foot and we needed to be aggressive with everything. And I think Gary Storer wins the ball after 20, 30 seconds, plays a great ball to uh, Dakari and they're on the back foot straight away. And you no, know, they had bits of pressure and you can tell why they're at the top. They've got some good players, but let, let's be honest here. We asked the questions of the lads, you know, people doubted us. People uh, watching Saturday 800 were looking at it and thinking, bloody hell, what's going on here? And to be honest, so was I, because it wasn't us, and you've seen us. Mm. And um, then they put that in tonight, you think, that's us. That's what we want, that's the standard. We're not asking for any more. We're not asking for, you know, worldy performances of high skill. We like that, but let's put the graft in. And let the, the 600 odd people that were here tonight, the Kettering support, they'll go home happy. I mean, you said from the first five minutes, you could see it was a completely different setup and team from the team that um, played on Saturday. It, mm. You know, we said five minutes had gone. We've already done more in those five minutes <laughs> than we did on Saturday, which wasn't hard, was it? No. <laughs> Let's be honest. But um, no individual errors tonight either that cost us anything, was there? You know, it was a much more committed performance, and uh, it must be pleasing for you as well. I mean, we've been, you know, I hate to say it, but we have been unlucky in games to yeah. a certain extent. Mm. And Saturday was a huge, huge yeah. disappointment. But what a chalk and cheese performance, a Jekyll and Hyde performance. I mean, as you say, those are the standards. We now have to maintain them. And of course, we've got part two on Saturday. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, well, well, first of all, we, um, the, you know, we made the changes that we thought were, were right. And, you know, I said to them before the game, I could have made seven, eight, nine changes, but we ain't got that many players. Because McDonald's did well, didn't they? Yeah, no well, Cornell came on, done, was very steady and was good. And we could have made a lot of changes because Saturday wasn't us. And you go home after that and you really are depressed, pulling your hair out. And um, no, I, I think that we, me, myself, Frank and uh, Hoggy had a chat. Tozy came in, done great. You did. Sam Bennett, uh, Dakari, um, Salty. And you know, I've got to say, Salty's playing with an injury and he had a bit of a sickness bug. The lads went out there and done an hour for us, worked his socks off. That's the sort of commitment we've got in the squad. But we did let ourselves down on Saturday. But tonight, the people that came, the response from the fans, and I said to them, if we start bright, the fans will come with us. They'll well, come with us. I thought Ben Toteland was, was excellent. You know, he played his position well. He was he was up there, almost man of the match. Bennett ran himself into the ground, didn't mm. he? And uh, what a performance from him. Good refereeing for the penalty. Oh, definitely, because he pulled him back. Now, if he doesn't pull him back, he's got time to adjust and get the strike on. I thought the ref was spot on with it. And, you know, how many times have we missed out on penalties this season? Exactly. You know, only our second one. Yeah, and well, there's been three or four occasions. I can remember Buxton. Uh, I can remember Boston as well. The game's tight and we, they get penalty, but we don't. Well, that's, that's the situation of Boston. They get them. We're not allowed. <laughs> <laughs> right, yeah. So, um, but no, I, um, I've said to them there, you've set the standard now and um, we know what we can produce. But let's not step off it. We need to, we need to get out this league. We need to put them performances as, and we, we have played well on our travels. But you know that's another game at home. We've had our two wins at home. Uh, we want to build on it. Two one two now at home, isn't it? You know mm. what a win against the league leaders. I mean they're unbeaten in every competition until tonight. You know that's going to kick them in the proverbials for a while. They want to bounce back, obviously, on Saturday in the FA Cup. You know, again, we've got a tough game and we're away at Scarborough, but um, you said to me that there could be a couple of more players maybe coming in. You've brought one in. Are you still looking to, uh, but I know you are, <laughs> to bring some more? Yeah, well, I'd, like to, I'd like to help the group a bit. The group needs a little bit of help. Yeah. And um, we've got lads that need games as well. So uh, Neo's going out on loan. Um, he needs some games, young lad. We think a lot of him. We want to keep him involved, but the lad needs games. Um, so he's going to go out. There might be another go out, and there might be an addition come in. Um, but what, what we we want to build on this. We want to build on this. Now we're going to Kingsland Saturday. And, you know, it's a double header. We've done the business here. Can we go away and do it? Now standing here, they're a good side. They've got threats. Very good side. But uh, the walks is a nice pitch, 
and uh, we've got some lads that can pass the ball, so we'll have a go. Widrington is a good manager, isn't he? He, yeah. he knows his stuff. He's, uh, he's, he's no mug. He'll evaluate this game as you will do, obviously, mm. you know, and it'll be a different kind of game, I think, on Saturday. But mm. uh, what is good, I'm going back to, to tonight's game. I was delighted for Cam Gregory. He got a clean sheet because he's put in some fantastic performances and mm. hasn't been able to keep that clean sheet. And mm. uh, only a disappointment with Cam tonight, no penalty saves. Too. <laughs> <laughs> well, no, come on. Come on, let's just leave that one. But, um, no, in all honesty, he deserves. And so does the back three or back four. You know, we had the back three to start. That's what again, wasn't it? Yeah, and uh, he just said there he had a he had a bit of a knock on the head and we had a bit of double vision. I said we headed everything, so you know, <laughs> maintain that if you can. Um, but they're big lads of threat, and we thought in the second half that with our wing backs, their full backs were getting out and just putting balls in. So we changed it and went with two wingers to try and nullify that. But they still had a lot of ball, but. I think we could have went and got the next one if we were a bit clever on the, the transition and uh, maybe had the final pass a bit better. I think we could have got in again. For a neutral, it was a great game of football to watch, wasn't it? Very exciting, you know, which we haven't seen too much of in, in recent weeks, mm. especially Saturday, but ignore that. But so, yeah, it was a great game of football and uh, must have been everyone the power of good. You, me, the fans, you know, and the team, admittedly, will be delighted with it. We all heard them in the changing room as they came in. You know, they're, mm. they're up, aren't they? And uh, mm. that's great for them, I think, and uh, we need that confidence. Yeah, well, it means a lot to them. And um, we let ourselves down in front of our supporters Saturday, but bounced back with that. And also, I had a private couple of messages off players at the weekend saying they thought they'd let us down, which shows you that they care. Now, we understand the position we're in in the league, and hopefully that will move us up a bit. And uh, I always love uh, busting a couple of coupons, and I think we'd have done that tonight. Thank you, Lee. Brilliant. Uh, great game of football. We'll uh, see you on Saturday. Thank you.